फ्रेंड्स गुड इवनिंग एवरीबॉडी दिस इज श्यामल केयर आवर नेबरिंग कंट्री पाकिस्तान इज फेसिंग लॉट ऑफ प्रॉब्लम सो वोटिंग कैंसिल्ड नाउ व्हाट इज गोइंग टू हैपन एवरीथिंग इज नोन प्रोबेबली इट इज द मैटर ऑफ टाइम इट इज मैटर ऑफ टाइम दैट इज गोइंग टू बी डिसाइडेड विद द Imran Khan will continue as a prime minister or not it's not 1 million dollar question it is known it's matter of time friends <laughs> so much media hype and so much discussion so much uh, analysis by many pandits like sudhindra kulkarni and all they are telling that we should learn from Pakistan should learn from Indian democracy and all it's a good thing there are many expert they are speaking uh, Sudhendra Kulkarni like many people right so my purpose is not talking about this part i'm trying to understand pakistan's political uh, history after 1947 14th august so when uh, india and pakistan got independence pakistan 14th august and india 15th august okay jodwa bhai paida ho gaya jodwa bhai to jodwa bhai paida ho gaya to kya hone wala hai to ek dhang se india ka governor general la अब इंडिया चक्रगुप्ति राजा गोपालाचार्य इंडिया का गवर्नर जनरल हो गया एंड जवाहरलाल नेहरू ऑल्सो बिकमिंग द फर्स्ट प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया थ्री चेयर्स फॉर हिम थ्री चेयर्स बैक बाय महात्मा गांधी बैक बाय ब्रिटिश एंड बैक बाय लॉर्ड माउंट बैटन बॉक बाय ब्रिटिश राज ब्रिटिश रॉयल फैमिली ब्रिटिश रॉयल फैमिली nothing wrong it they got a prime minister pandit prime minister for india 1947 15 august it's a great moment for india no problem no problem no problem on the other side i was thinking i was thinking till that my ignorance was there i thought i thought uh, jinna was the first prime minister of india i was so ignorant about the whole thing about because i am not a historian i have studied history up to 8th standard today i enriched my knowledge that uh, mohammad ali jinna was not the prime minister of india he is the first governor general of pakistan he was handling all the portfolios including the prime minister and including uh, the other defense and everything because at initial stage uh, it was the provision that governor general uh, will be taking care of everything then the rest will follow that it took 2 3 years time to stabilize things nothing wrong in it it's like inaugurating your own house you got your new house right चलता है चलता है चलता है बेड नहीं है तो क्या है जमीन पे सो जाएंगे चलता है चलता है गैस नहीं है तो क्या है हम स्टोव में खाना बना लेंगे ऐसा ही हुआ पहले दो तीन साल ऐसा ही थोड़ा सा चक्कर चला चक्कर 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 मतलब मतलब ऑर्गेनाइजिंग थिंग्स इट टेक्स टाइम राइट इन एनी थिंग एट होम इन greater level like a nation and all these things are very common portfolio right uh, all the portfolio will be with the prime minister and later on like you no know, it will be distributed on time that that kind of provisions are there because you need to select the people whom to be selected kind of thing but in uh, present day what is happening right many chief ministers they are keeping all the portfolio throughout the five years wherever they there chief minister finance minister education minister and their the external affairs all home ministry 
many portfolio has taken one prime minister many times in chief minister present day also they are holding all kind of irrigation education and all kind of tourism and finance everything one person is holding nothing wrong in it if somebody is intelligent one can hold like no if you are very intelligent you can uh, teach history geography philosophy politics uh, sociology economics mathematics uh, physics chemistry biology all those subjects one can teach no problem no problem no problem sometimes political leader has too much over ambitious they are very knowledgeable they feel and that's why they want to hold all kind of portfolio good thing bad thing i don't know so in true democracy how good and how bad it is i really do not know i am not an politician but my purpose of telling this chakra gobbarti raja gopal acharya is also chief minister of tamil nadu he was also governor of west bengal he is also called mango of salem district salem salem in south there is a salem district is there he is a very quiet knowledgeable person and also he is uh, totally a peaceful man he is against war he didn't like this 1945 uh, second world war at all chakraborty raja gopal acharya i thought he was a bengali fellow now no he is not a bengali chakraborty okay i do not know the background but i know it but i am not going to discuss this things so over here uh, that is not he is very much indian and he is a very much nationalistic person and he was also a bharat ratna award respect chakraborty raja gopal acharya and other side mohammad ali jinnah first governor general of pakistan he is also a nationalist and uh, born in karachi no problem his birth date is little bit here and there school says his birth date is x and actual birth date is something different that time it was nice there is no problem but uh, that point what i want to refer over here is uh, mohammad ali jinnah's father right uh, is a parsi gentleman and uh, his wife is also is very much uh, linked to hindu family hindu 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 i told about it so mithi bhai mithi bhai college in mumbai i was not knowing i was working there for government of india there you know office uh, research office big unit is there mithi bhai college uh, nearby it's a very good uh, renowned college show friends uh, mohammad ali jinnah is having hindu origin and the specific religion also they converted to muslim jinnah studied in karachi and also he went to christian school then went to london and studied many times uh, he was very much linked to british uh, royal family good politician that time he was a powerful person and he was meeting dada bhai nauroji and everybody who were there he is involved with indian national congress movement uh, uh, dada bhai nauroji was there very much in london and uh, contrary i could see uh, jawaharlal nehru and mahatma gandhi also went to london for studies for law he is also he was uh, about to pursue law but uh, he could complete his education in uh, different political science kind of thing he is uh, he is more of uh, i personally believe here jinna is more uh, of academically clear and sound compared to our two great politician that time all are london written no problem no problem no problem friends what i was trying to talk about mahatma 
this mouth um, jinna jinna i personally believe that he is more of a secular man than compared to mahatma gandhi and jawaharlal nehru if i say so i should not be leading to a kind of a controversy but i could see the background over there his educational qualification is visu his views on the political ideology many things he has taken sannyas also once upon a time from the politics and uh, his muslim league after that he went uh, for a lot of personal loss his wife died in london mother died in london and uh, that affects his education but uh, he continued his education for a long time and uh, uh, mohammad ali jinnah's mother was mithi bai i told you and uh, his uh, family member was one of the khoja caste in maharashtra that time khoja caste is a hindu khoja caste and uh, they have converted to taken into islam that is they have accepted it is as nothing i do not have any any question towards this uh, this part i talked about his date of birth is december 25 1876 but record in karachi pakistan school says that is october 28 1875 he was born nothing wrong because that time maintaining records sometimes people ask me how when your son die uh, born right now they say even if you see he was the eldest of seven children of uh, jinna bhai punja p w o n g a right jinna bhai and he is jinna jinna is the sir name okay jinna bhai am bhai bolta bhai it is not bhai okay uh that is what it is right and he studied also mumbai university and that time university of mumbai or uh, university of bombay current date you talk about university of mumbai india right right up uh, on his uh, advice uh, his english friend his father decided to send him to england to acquire business experience jinna however had a different set of mind and become a barrister uh, in keeping with these customs of the time his parents arranged for an early marriage and this marriage within one year finished okay 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 no problem this is part of the loss uh in london he joined like no lincoln in uh, in corporation one of the legal societies uh, that prepared students for the bar right in 1895 at the age of 19 he was called in the bar while in london jinna suffered two losses that is what i have told you uh all those things uh, william grandstone and this uh, greatly influenced by this leader who become the prime minister of england right she was very much influenced right and uh, i told about dada bhai nauru ji and uh, leading indian nationalist board in the british parliament many places he has got better role his activities in london is much uh, better than mahatma gandhi and uh, jawaharlal nehru this much i can tell you friends today my purpose is not talking about uh, mohammad ali jinnah my purpose was little different i was enriched with an idea or knowledge that he was not the prime minister he was the governor general and that is a good part or bad part i don't know but uh, this is what i have learned today okay let me talk about uh, 
list of prime minister of pakistan that i am trying to tell you that how much time they have served uh, that is quite interesting prime minister right prime minister first prime minister i told it is not mohammad ali jinnah it is uh, liaquat ali khan <laughs> uh, i have made my again corrections so 14th august 1957 left office uh, 16th october 1951 he was assassinated okay oil 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 what about the next part it is uh, sir kauza nazau naziu din what is the april uh, 17th april 1953 so one year just one year 182 days he was there as a prime minister see the instability part i was talking to tell you mohammad ali bogra it is uh, 12 august uh, 1953 just for two years 117 days right next choudhury muhammad uh, is coming 12th september 1956 just for one year 31 days right it's just as a like you no know, you need to have a maturity of a baby eight months nine months ten months something like that but he was there just for one year 365 another 13 months only <laughs> okay no problem no problem what are these uh sahid suhadi and he is uh, 17th october 1957 just for one year 35 days this previous fellow of one year 31 days is one year 35 days. It's, it's a kind of a nice thing that is what happened, right? Next one is Ibrahim Ismail Chindigar. Okay, 17 December 1957, right? And it's just for 60 days. Just for 60 days. Just for 60 days, my video sometimes goes for 5 hours, 6 hours, 7 hours, but 60 days is too much to be a Prime Minister in anybody's office, right? It's like you no know, joining and resigning. A lot of people, they join somebody's office for two days, says, I want to work for your company, you join. The very next day he doesn't like this kind of work and all he leave it's for only for how many days it's too much only for 60 days now sir Feroz Khan Noon uh, that is 7th October 1958 he's for 295 days uh, not even completed one year, one year. Another thing is uh, Nurul Alim, uh, Nurul Amin, uh, 20th December 1971. He is there for only for 13 days, uh, only for 13 days is too much pain, right? And uh, 13 days. So another gentleman is coming. Jufikar Ali Bhutto. <laughs> Fifth July nineteen hundred seventy-seven. Three years, three hundred twenty-five days. Kaise lag raha hai? Acha lag raha hai. Muhammad Khan Juniza. He is twenty-nine May nineteen hundred eighty-eight. Three years. 66 days well 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 and another is Benazir Bhutto Benazir Bhutto 6th August 1990 right 1990 one year 247 days well 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 you know the fate of Benazir Ali Bhutto what had happened 
many prime minister they are assassinated the least one i'm referring like no his father right bhutto and benazir bhutto you know the fate well now friends and uh, i'm talking about nawaz sharif how sharif it is right he was uh, in july 1993 two years uh, 254 days uh, 1990 just moving out nawaz sharif sharif ji abhi bhi aap you are still very much in london i believe oh everybody is taken center benjamin ali bhutto also taken center everybody is london is a hub for all the chief minister or the prime minister who are thrown out or removed from their post they have taken center in london again benjamin bhutto is coming coming back 1996 to 5th november 3 years 17 days and uh, 1993 so it is pakistan people's party she was a nice speaker she speaks well no problem again nawaz sharif is coming back there are two prime minister uh, like you know, they are coming back again reelecting after certain time exile coming back reelecting that's a nice thing that is what happening again uh, nawaz sharif is coming back uh, 12th october 1999 two years 237 days 1997 and pakistan muslim league that is his party right muslim league mohammad ali jinnah namaste chacha namaste namaste mr khan jamali jafarullah khan jamali 26 june 2004 one year 216 days right and uh, choudhury sujat hasan uh, 26 august 2004 He just for 57 days not even completed 2 months ah then uh, shokot ajaz uh, and this 15th november 2007 3 years 79 days then is coming uh, raza gilani is a nice speaker kind of thing he speaks well right he is 19 june 2012 4 years uh, 86 days uh, is very close to 5 years so it's nice probably he's the longest serving probably yes probably raja parvez uh, asraf uh, is 24th march 2013 for 200 only 75 days now again nawaz sharif can you imagine third time he is coming okay is 28th july 2017 4 years 53 days well 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 no problem nawaz sharif nawaz sharif sahid uh, abbasi he is uh, just for 303 days uh, 31st may 2018 is living okay this is pakistan muslim league okay no problem no problem now mr imran khan the cricketer the great cricketer great leader great sportsman handsome boy <laughs> very handsome so he is joining 18th august 2018 uh, incumbent 3 years 220 days uh, that is the issue over here whether he is going to continue or he wants to move out only time will decide decide he is already told the reelection reelection or army chief is going to hand over or take care this part that is the tradition let's see that part friends i am going to now switch over to uh, another topic or the president post pakistan list of president in pakistan 
Now Nawaz Sharif is uh, three times Prime Minister of India, not a single Prime Minister of India. They have completed the five years tenure. But if you see in India, I talked about that, but the stability part, if you see Jawaharlal Nehru, Indra Gandhi, little bit emergency time, again, after the Rajiv Gandhi, then uh, Janta Dal few Prime Minister, after that you have uh, Atal Bihari Bajpai, then Manmohan Singh and uh, now Modi ji. Now if you see how many Prime Minister in Pakistan, if I close my eyes uh, last 75 years close to 25 Prime Minister, if I am not wrong, but in India, very few. Jawaharlal Nehru, Indira Gandhi, then uh, Choudhury Charan Singh, and Debo Gouda, Rajiv Gandhi, Manmohan Singh, uh, and uh, what you call it, another is uh, Narendra Modi ji, before that, uh, Bajpai ji was there, then uh, there are few Prime Minister for few years, even it is not, I think there will be 10 or 11 Prime Minister, overall, not more than that. See, I do not have the script, but uh, if I just close my eyes, uh, probably I can recall all the Prime Minister well and their faces. I told Debo Gouda and I told uh, those things are names are already I have told there are few Prime Minister is for few days. Okay, those things not to be considered as a part of history of 75 years. The major share Jawaharlal Nehru close to 13 14 years, Indira Gandhi maybe again 12-13 years and uh, Rajiv Gandhi again taken more number of years, Manmohan Singh has taken more number of years, Modi ji close to 10 years, Bajpai ji all two times uh, he become the Prime Minister, he also completed a quite number of years. So then Janta Dal and all those things, emergency time sometimes is when to an emergency. Chaudhuri Charan Singh, VP Singh. Oh, 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 I have forgotten VP Singh. How can I forget VP Singh? VP. <laughs> very, very important personalities in uh, Indian politics. The reservation, the man uh, who has taken the reservation into another dimension, level two, level three. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, VP Singh. Chandra Shikhar. Chandra Sekhar, Chandra Sekhar is the is a first uh, Kishan leader. Kishan, Kishan, Kishan. Ah. So I am now recalling, right? I, my memory is going back. One more gentleman, I am not able to recall his name. Maybe end of my presentation, I will recall. Only one thing I want to convey over here, here, is the. Prime Minister, how many? 11 or 12, 25, 26 Prime Minister for 10 days, 20 days, 1 month, 2 months, 3 months. The instability is, uh, is one of the things probably that is eroding the democracy of Pakistan. So, what are the external or internal forces that is not able to stabilize any government? It is important to have a stable government, to have a stable economy. Because the aspiration or uh, the kind of uh, reform policies that is taking place or what they want to do in their planning and everything, you need to have time. It's just for two months if somebody is there in the office, three months for one year, what development uh, the person will be doing. Even he cannot do his own development, that much I can tell you. 
he might be carrying all kind of luggage from Karachi to uh, this place what is called Islamabad because uh, leaders are not from the Karachi the way our Indian leaders are not it, it can come from any direction you have to go settle down right it's like taking a flight from uh, Kolkata to Mumbai and you are you become Prime Minister of Pakistan in uh, imagine right now in a, in a airport in Karachi and landing to where landing to maybe Islamabad it's one or two hours travel or whatever time then you are coming down and resigning or somebody is throwing you out for two hours so this kind of things it is too much to digest right I talked about Imran Khan could have been continued as a cricket commentator and all uh, he's a good speaker he speaks well that is what I like Imran Khan in early age when I was a MSc student the World Cup match I remember Imran Khan winning the World Cup match I could see the spirit of uh, Imran Khan but in politics it's a different thing altogether it is not you you cannot do you as an individual you have limited things because convincing others <laughs> it is another factors right now you can individually play and you can take away game from one dimension to another dimension that much skill Imran Khan had and that led him to take the World Cup I, I am not wrong in 1991 or 92 he's winning the Pakistan winning the World Cup match under the belt of Imran Khan. It was a nice thing. I am from Asian country and winning it. It's a good thing. Imran Khan has got the leadership quality that is a very good thing I could see. But in politics, I told about well, it is a different ball game and uh, altogether. Uh, let me come back to the list of president I told you like I just want to tell few names like no Iskandar Mirja it is right uh, it is uh, took office in 1956 and uh, left office 58 1900 Ayub Khan is coming uh, 1958 is moving out in 8 June 1962, right? I Khan. Then Pakistani Cup Diet, 8 June 1962, right? And uh, Muhammad Abjal Chima, it is again uh, 11 June 1962, is moving out uh, 29 November. 1963. Then Fazul Kadir Choudhury is uh, 29 November 1963 and 12 June 1965. Right. Ayub Khan again is coming here 12 June 1965, 31st March 1969. Right. Ahe Khan, Ahe Khan is coming 25th March 1969 and 20th December 1971 and uh, Jufi Ali Bhutto, I talked about, you just see the Jufi Ali Bhutto, if I am not wrong, he is holding two positions, he served as a Prime Minister and now the President, he says, he's 20th December 1971 and 13th August 1973. Okay, he's from Pakistan People's Party. Now Fazal Lila Choudhury again uh, 
is coming 14th August 73, 20th April uh, 1978. Uh, okay, it's serving a little longer time. Sick. Anul Hawk again coming uh, 20th April 1978, 7th May 1978. This is for April, May, June, July. 28th April to 20th May, April, May, even not for even one month, okay. Even not for one month, not for uh, 17 days only. And uh, Fazal Ali Choudhury again, uh, 7th May 1978, 16th September 1978, for a very short time. Uh, Muhammad Ziaul Haq again, uh, 16th September 78. 17th August 1988 and uh, another Gulam Asik Khan he is 17th August 88 July 1993 so again uh, Wasim Sajid uh, is coming 8th July 1973 4th November 1993 Farooq Legari is coming 14th November 1993, 2nd December 1997, right? Wasim Sajid and again 2nd December 1997, 1st January 1998. Then uh, Tariq Tarar here, 1st January 1998, 28th June 2001. Farbiz Musarraf, yes, Farbiz Musarraf, much fight time. June 2000, uh, 20th June 2001 and uh, 6th October 2007, right? Right, for Biz Musarov again, uh, 2006 October 2007 to 2008. Again, Mohammed Mia Sumro is 18th August 2008 to 9th. September 2008 Asif Ali Jardari This is Bhutto husband uh, Jardari ka husband uh, 9 September 2008 and 9 September 2013 Okay Right, no problem Mahmud Hashan 9 September 2013 9 September 2018 and Asif Ali, the present uh, one is 9 September 2008 to this present day. So friends, what I was trying to talk about, the instability both in Prime Minister and President and in Pakistan is very much uh, instable, right? If you take all those things, they are coming from the army, the army general and getting into this kind of position taking over and uh, many things had happened if you see most of the things are corruption charges hanged and they went up to this level but in india if you see none of the prime minister of india none of the president of india is been charged with uh, kind of a corruption level or taken into court, nothing like that. We are we are a Shanti Priyo Manus, Shanti Priyo Bhalo Manus, Bhadralok, Bhadralok. Even if you see the president, our president of India is highly qualified. They are mostly from academic background, not from the political background. Some are lawyers, some are, if I name these things will be clear. <laughs> starting from Dr. Rajendra Prashad to present day, all are qualified, right? Everybody, there are many. So, Dr. Abdul Kalam and uh, Dr. Pranam Mukherjee. Many people they have come and uh, 
in uh, india i can uh, let me tell you i told you there are two differences of thought process still india i could see if i rate india is much more fair and much more qualified much more sharper people or non political people they have come into the president post the political post is the prime minister's post elected people they have joined in their capabilities i have nothing to talk about that part talking about the radha krishnan and all they are the they have their own contribution in education even there are little controversy here and there it doesn't bother me or it doesn't matter to me at the end of the day but if i when i compare with pakistan or at least they have much more stability in that context and they have peacefully accepted the job and peacefully also left the office but here in pakistan it's too much chaos so our freedom is also chaos and uh, pakistan i don't like to say i wish they should be solving their internal problem i'm nobody to speak india must uh, be very careful what is happening in the other side of our neighboring nation our brother once again thank you very much bye bye take care bye bye bye